to another Tableau tutorial video. Today I'm going to show you how you can show the states or display the states even when there isn't any data in them. For example, I had a client come to me and say, hey, I've got employees scattered across the country. I want to see how many employees or what states are impacted by what organization. Come over here, select the organization, A, B, C, but the client did not want to see all this grayscale. They wanted all the states filled out. So how do we do that? Well, let's go to the data source. Come down here to the left-hand corner, click data source. Okay, so we have all of our data employees by state. What we need to do is come up here. I've previously created a table. It was in Excel, but had all the states listed. We're going to drag it over. Instead of joining it, you see there's a little red box that says drag table to union. We're going to drop the st all states in there. Now what that does, I'm going to show you in this data table down below. You have the states. This is the, and the abbreviation, this is from the all state table. So you can see as we scroll down the number of employees, that's null. This is important. So you're not going to have any organization associated with these states or employee count. Now you're going to have the U.S. state, the organization, the managers, employees, the original data. Now coming over to this table here, a couple things we needed to do. We created a new dimension called plotted states. I'm going to show you what that looks like. Basically we're saying if the state is blank, we're going to pick the U.S. state. So the U.S. state belongs to one table, the state belongs to the other. So this way we have one field with a state populated for every record. Next thing we did is we came down here, we created a parameter, lower right hand corner. Gave it a name, select organization. This is going to be a string all and we imp inserted the values from the org field okay we also added an all column right so we added all to both and that's what you see over here off to the far right the selected org you see a b c and all you can sort those if you wanted by editing the uh, parameter control now coming back over we're looking at this filter called plotted org and this is important okay so if the organization equals the parameter control and if you look at the far right the parameter control says a b or c then or oh, let's just do it this way if the org equals what's selected in the parameter control or if the org is null, so remember we had all those states added from my list of all the states, so if that's null, or if the org, the, the parameter control equals all, then we're going to have it that this field equals zero. Okay, so this becomes a, a filter, and it's going to be kind of a yes-no filter. I've already dragged it up here to the org, the plotted org. We have plotted states, and we've moved the employee count, the sum of the employees, over to the color. I don't know if we need this. I think we need this still. I'll show you what happens if you don't. So it doesn't have the, the data. So you need to bring over the plotted state under details, because that's what you're plotting. And then the org, I've added that to the tooltip just so that we can see, um, so we can scroll over, so we can see what the org is. Now, now you press A or B or C, and the, the states that don't have any employees show up as blank, and the states that have employees show up as darker color. Now one more thing that I did have to do is I had to come under color here 
edit the colors and I had to where is it I had to change this originally was the value of 10 so I had to change advanced and I had to set the start equal zero okay so that would pick up the the null values all right there you go a couple tricks there but that's how you can get all the states showing even if there's not an organization. Oh, one other thing that I did under this is I just excluded Alaska and Hawaii. The client didn't want to show those. There you go. Hope you enjoy. Please leave a comment and um, subscribe.